slip Then it's funny cause they slipping Me I'm never missing You can pick the heat dog I beat you with the pistons Listen, comprehend this and pay attention Brutal sims like LeBron No one can What up? What up? It's your boy you don't know brutal sim on the scene wicked of me with a next video for y'all man i ain't gonna front bro all right this is some serious loyalty to y'all man i i just came home had a little something to drink a little tipsy saw this tweet i still i'm still doing this video for y'all man all right i'm being judged i'm being judged right now by certain people that y'all not able to see but it's all good i still got y'all though all right so we're gonna go through this tweet real quick and i'm gonna put the link to the screenshots and i want y'all to come back in the comments and let me know what y'all think all right so let's get straight to it man all right now this is from brendan donahue i think i pronounced it right i didn't christen him of course all right he's the nba 2k league md so he put out this basically trying to assure us that the the selection process was fair and there was no tampering in in the process man so let's go through this and let me know what y'all think in the comments all right dear 2k community over the past couple of months we've seen incredible excitement throughout the 2k community for our inaugural season and i can't thank you enough for the, for your support while there has been so much momentum recently there has been some rumors and speculations out there and i want to take the time to address these concerns to assure you that the integrity of this league is of utmost importance one sec i need to sit man i ain't gonna front some good stuff man y'all should try some anyway anyways let's continue all right um first we went to great lengths to develop a fair evaluation process to give us the best chance of identifying the top 102 players in the world who will best who will be the first NBA 2K League players? This was no easy task. Of the 9 million players globally, oh, putting up your chest, that's what I'm talking about. Put out these numbers, man. Let them know 9 million. 72,000 of you notched 50 wins during the January qualifier, with roughly 15,000 of you per position completing, competing for just 250 final qualifying spots we added more windows so incredibly skilled players outside of north america outside of north america could be discovered and we gave players an extra day to submit their application when the system went down all right that was generous shout out to you all for that all right in the quest to find the top 102 players i personally reached out to some of the prospects via social channels to gather information requiring required to supplement missing data including missing email addresses all right there's the missing email address a nice setup I like that while so many of you perform incredibly well we unfortunately do not have enough roster spots for each of you and i am truly sorry for that many of you have raised concerns over cav legion's manager anthony Miracles text with mr styles First time I heard someone say Mr. Stars, nah, that's interesting. <laughs> I completely understand. I would be skeptical too if I didn't know what happened. In the spirit of transparency, here are the screenshots. Here are screenshots with timestamps showing exactly where the miscommunication and ensuing confusion happened. As you can see on the screenshots, and the link is gonna be there, make sure and check it out. We notify our teams at 11.52 a.m. on Friday via our internal NBA 2K League Discord that all 250 players had been emailed. This prompts several team representatives to repost the confirmation to their own feeds. Around that time, Anthony followed up with a text to our lead player evaluator concerning that concerned that Mr. Styles hadn't made the pool. As you can see in the screenshots, Mr. Styles already was already in the 250, while Anthony had no input or effect on the final 250. His conversation time stamped between 11.58 a.m. and 12.15 p.m. alerted us to the fact that Mr. Styles 
while on the list of 250 players had not yet received his email. An issue that affected Mr. Styles and one other player in the 250. We then worked to fix the issue and notified the affected players by 4 p.m. that same day. Fair enough. Now I got conspiracy to put out there, man. I probably shouldn't. But who is to say there was 250? They put out two extra, but who's to say there was 250? All right. Now, finally, while I know we posted a blog this past weekend outlining the evaluation process, I realize some of you still have some questions. One thing we cannot stress enough is that there were some fantastic 2K players who did not receive an interview. That doesn't take away from their combined performance. There were simply more elite players than spots we had available in the league i i could agree to that. i could understand that no doubt a lot of people play this game man all right here's a deeper explanation of the evaluation advanced statistics we had access to more than double the stats categories that players could see on their dashboards for example dribble move count ball poke loose on ball steal efficiency jump shot timing the block efficiency Two, consistency of gameplay. We looked at the distribution of players, game performances, and reward rewarded players that were consistent rather than streaky. Matchmaking rating. We created the matchmaking rating system that retroactively looked at the skill level of the opponents and those on the team. A simple win-loss record do not tell the entire story. Fair enough. I like, I like, I like this info y'all dropping, man. Alright, last but not least. Drop rates and stats from drop games. As we mentioned, during the combine, all game and statistics were recorded. Whether or not a player finished the game, I that is quit, drop, or dashboard. And whether or not the stats and win loss showed up on the player dashboard. It was all available at and factored into the evaluation. I hope this provides more insight into the process and I will be connecting with all of you live again soon. I look forward to continuing the conversation with you and we continue to grow this league. Best regards, Brandon Donahue, Managing Director of the NBA 2K League right and that's about it now let, let's look these are the um i'm going to put the link of course to his twitter make sure and check it out it's going to be at the top of his twitter so i'm going to definitely put the link so make sure come check out these dms and messages and let me know what you all think about this letter i'm probably going to post this tonight man. I know, i'm probably going to post it tonight late it's going to be up late um if you're here in the morning still you know how it is man so make sure check it out make sure and like the video i ain't going front man it's late i'm doing this video for y'all i just got done uploading the video i'm gonna do this and put this out for y'all because i need everyone to keep up to date on what's going on man you know that's what i'm about so you already know man it's your boy sim let me know what y'all think about this situation let me know what y'all think about this letter is this believable we all believe what he's saying. Look at the timestamps, bro. All right. I'm not going to check out the timestamps right now. I'm a little bit too tipsy for that, for that, to be quite honest. I'm sorry, my words. It is what it is. <laughs> all right. It's not that important, but it is entertaining from this, from this standpoint for me. All right. So let me know what you all think in the comments. Your boy Sim, your first time to my channel. Like the video. Share the video. Hit your boy subscribe. If it's not your first time, like the video. Share the video. You never know. Always gonna be informed. Always gonna help. Your boy still want love, respect. Bless up.